Kyle woke up. Kyle quickly crouched down on the floor, realizing his immediate need for... Kyle began to comb through the damp piles of filth and mold on his floor in search of helpful items. After finding and eating a few bits of crumbs and old cheese, Kyle found something much more important. Indeed, it was the corpse of Harry, a friend that had gone missing years ago while at Kyle's house. Kyle was glad to see him again, but was unsure of whether to interrupt such an important day with Harry business. Kyle hoisted Harry onto his shoulder and took him outside. Kyle began dragging Harry's body down the street, drawing many, many stairs. Kyle knew exactly where he needed to take Harry's corpse, on a lovely playdate, just the two of them. Kyle and Harry started at the arcade. Kyle used Harry's arms to operate the joysticks and push buttons. After five or six different games, the two friends had enough tickets for a single candy bar. They took their prize to the local park for eating. Kyle tried to feed some of the chocolate bar to Harry, but Harry seemed to not have an appetite. After eating, Kyle noticed a nearby playground. He dragged Harry over. Kyle tried to figure out a way to swing Harry onto the swing set, but, lacking the ability to grip, Harry kept falling out. Instead, Kyle started to lug Harry to the top of the slide and shove him down time and time again. Finally, Kyle took Harry to the movies to see as many popular films as their pocket change allowed. Kyle quickly found that he had no pocket change, so he searched through Harry's pockets until he found his wallet. Kyle bought two tickets to A Love Romance. After getting inside, Kyle left Harry to go find a restroom. By the time Kyle had finished using the restroom, he had forgotten that he brought Harry along. Kyle watched A Love Romance by himself. Harry's corpse sat on a bench in the atrium. While Kyle was in the movie, a beautiful thing happened. Harry's corpse, imbued with the power of friendship and love, was reanimated. Harry's old, rotten flesh gained color and life. His fingernails regrew. His missing eye came back. By the time the movie was over, Harry was able to greet Kyle with a large, friendly hug as his old self. Kyle was confused but delighted to have his long-lost friend meet him on his way out of the theater. The two made plans to get drinks together and parted ways for the day. Kyle returned home, forgetting about the interview with Rachel. 